Welcome back to the channel. I want to read you a passage from an article that talks about a company that Microsoft recently acquired called Two Hat. And the reason they acquired this company is to help them in assisting with moderating on Xbox Live. And this is the sentence that I felt a little trepidation when I read. It says, Microsoft also has a much broader goal of being able to filter out Xbox Live party sessions in the future so live audio calls can be filtered with real-time bleeps similar to broadcast TV. Now, I want you to imagine that you purchase an Android phone or you purchase an iPhone. Android owns the operating system. Apple owns the operating system. You purchase the phone. Now, they own the operating system, so conceivably, I can see the argument that they should be able to do what they want with it. But imagine you make a phone call with your Android phone or your iPhone, and you're talking to somebody conceivably that you know. Should they be able to listen into that conversation and edit it or filter it because you're saying things that they feel you shouldn't be saying? Now, if you're in an Xbox Live party, conceivably, you're in that party with people that you know people that you play with on a regular basis. Should Microsoft be able to listen in to that Xbox Live party session and filter out what you're saying because they feel it's inappropriate? Now, I don't think this is something that could ever really be implemented in any, in any real way because I don't think that anybody wants anybody listening to conversations that they have, especially if you're implementing the party with people and it's a private party and you're all in the party talking to one another who's to say what is and isn't appropriate between people that know each other when they're talking and having a good time what is scary is that they even thought that this was something that they could just do let's listen in to xbox live parties and bleep out words that we don't like let's listen into conversations between people who are willingly and willfully engaging in conversation in a party together. Let's listen in for words we don't like and edit them out. Now, I don't think anybody would argue that if you're in a public forum, you can't just say things that are completely offensive without any sort of filter, especially because Microsoft owns that. But there has to be some sort of right to privacy when it comes to an Xbox Live party between you and someone else that you play with. You're in the party together. You're speaking to one another together. And I don't know if there is an expectation of privacy in an Xbox Live party. Let's say that there isn't. Would you really want to be on a service that's listening into every single conversation you're having with friends in a party together? I certainly wouldn't want to do that. And I don't think most people would. Again, it's just like using your phone to talk to someone. Apple owns the e ecosystem. Android owns the ecosystem. Just because they own the ecosystem, do they have the right to listen into private conversations? I could see if you're on a public forum again, but a private conversation between two people, I'm not sure that they should be listening in for words that they don't like and then implementing a filter. Now, it's very possible that in the fine print when we sign up for Xbox Live, all of this is covered and is legal. They can do whatever they want. They can listen into your private parties because they're not private and they could edit out words that they don't like. How far does it go? If they don't like you hearing certain th things, what happens if they don't like you seeing certain things? What happens if their own content, the own, their own creative process is governed by this? What happens if you can only see and play and experience the things that they find not offensive. You see where I'm going with this? The idea of listening in to an Xbox Live party between two people seems like a bit of an overreach to me. And while I don't think in a public forum you should be able to just say things that, that are absolutely offensive to people, I do think that there should be some privacy if you're in a party with people that you know and you're talking to one another, having a good time. Who's to say what is and isn't a joke? Who's to say what somebody that you know t takes as a joke versus somebody 
that the moderator knows that it wouldn't take as a joke and then just editing out your own private party. It just doesn't feel right. So at the end of the day, this might be nothing. Nothing might come of this. But I think just the idea that they're thinking along these lines, they're actually thinking about editing out what two people or four people or however many people in a party say to one another, listening into that party and actually bleeping out the words that they don't like, listening for the sentences that they don't agree with. It just seems like a very, very odd place to be in. So that's going to be it for the video. Let me know what you think in the comment section below about this. Thanks for watching it. Share it out on your favorite social media platform of choice. Maybe subscribe to the channel. At the very least, hit that like button. It helps me grow the channel. Xbox Live, cleaning it up. How far is too far? Let me know in the comments section below. Thanks for watching.